best uh, body cam. There's an amalgamation of things wrong here. Crashed into a tree. It's a whole soap opera. <laughs> I don't know what to expect from this one, but it comes from Code Blue Cam and it says simple traffic stop turns into sudden nightmare. Hmm. Very 2023, an officer was conducting routine patrol when he began following an SUV in Waukesha, Wisconsin. The 30 year old male driver named Rudolph had shown signs of potential impaired driving Rudolph. by swerving within his lane. Honestly, Rudolph is such a good name. Rudolph, it's a good full bodied first name. Give him a little nickname of Ru. Very, very cute. That's a good name. Now, I know this guy's about to be a piece of shit, but it's a good name. When he began crossing the center line, the officer decided to initiate a traffic stop. How did it turn into a nightmare? Go on. Good, how are you? Good. Good. Officer Bacoris, walk shop, please. Reason for your stop today is you were over the the line over here, and then also you were in the bike lane coming down oh, east. Yeah. Any reason for that? No, we were just trying to get home. Honestly, like the car in front of us, I felt like they were getting kind of close, but I understand why you, you know, why you were concerned, and that's why I just like. Dude, his demeanor is actually so kind, but he's also got that drunk stare going on. Yeah. I totally get it, officer. I super get it. What was your reason for coming in here? Uh, it was com it was honestly because like that car honestly? was really close. I was like concerned and concerned yeah. for what? Yeah, we have a newborn and I didn't want any complications. Like honestly, you can look in oh. the back, you can check all that and like honestly, What do you mean by complications? Oh. No, what I meant by like, I didn't want you to think that there was anything concerning. You know, we're trying to make it home and like her mom is literally waiting for us. Okay. And, like, she can show you all the ID and all that. Oh you guys my have God. IDs on you? Yeah, Wait. we do. And, I mean, you can tell he's drunk and he's got a newborn in the, did he say the newborn is in the car or the newborn is home? Okay, the baby is not in the car. While standing by the vehicle, the officer observed his speech was slurred and detected a strong odor of alcohol emanating from the vehicle. Any weapons in the vehicle? No, not at all. Any illegal drugs? No, okay. How much alcohol have we had tonight? Okay, how, how about you, boss? Uh, probably less than her, but check my ID. It's just, everything's good, man. We're literally like... How many, how much did you have to drink is what I'm asking. Uh, probably um, one or two. Got, yeah, but like, one or we two also what? left no. at like... At like 6 o'clock p.m., man. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you left at me. 6 o'clock p.m.? Yes, like, we left you my apartment. Like, we're literally just trying to make it down the street. It's me. Right. I, I'm just wondering, because you guys are saying you come come from the restaurant. I can smell the intoxicants coming from the vehicle, so I'm just trying yeah, to see if you're safe it's to drive. Totally me. The reason why I stopped you is because you were going over the, the line in the bike lane coming down East Avenue, and then also the line over here, so that's why I'm trying to figure out. So how many drinks did you have, sir? Um, check. Holy car, like, how two. many? Like, I, I Do you have a license on you? Okay, this is probably an odd question to ask, but for people that do drink, how many drinks does it take for you to start slurring? I would have to get to like three and a half to four drinks in a short span of time to like start slurring, you know? Like when you're slurring, okay, we're kind of like on the same page. Eight, girl, what the f***? <laughs> we're kind of on the same page. I see a couple twos in there, but like, I think for most people that like probably drink, you gotta have at least like floor. And this guy is slurring. I want you guys hang tight here, okay? I'm gonna run him through fields. Okay. The reason why I stopped him is he was like going a little bit over the bike lane, coming down east. Mm -hmm. And then also, when we turned on the sunset here, he was over the center the line. I'm gonna run him real quick. I think I should just do him here. Yeah. Might as well. Nice and, uh, nice and flat. Upon running Rudolph's info, dispatch advised he had a revoked driving status. Oh no, this means he's revoked. He's a liar. Through Illinois? Yeah, status revoked. Hit up Leanna, she can confirm that. I don't, maybe she can do something more on her end too, because it would, it'd be nice to see if he's revoked for an OWI, you know what I mean? Is he up visiting? Uh, he's not making much sense. Oh really? He's like, I'm just trying to get home. We have a baby at home. I was like, he's, he's always dodging around my questions. Do you have your idea? I have it on me. But anyways, we were just trying to get home. 
Oh, being real evasive with his answers and trying to change your line of questioning. Yes. How'd you guys end up over here? He pulled in. I was going to stop him. And he pulled in and he started going all the way around. I was like, why'd you come over here? He's like, honestly, the car in front of me, I didn't want anything to do with them. I didn't want you guys to think. I, I was like, what the, what are you talking about? 406, go ahead. 406, Rudolph, Jennifer Falls. 10-4, could you advise reason for revocation? I want to find out if he's got prior OWIs through Illinois. I'll ask her later. <laughs> yeah, you might have to just do fields and ask her after. Well, Dude, she's tell still us working why. on that anyway, so I'm going to do it now. All right, Rudolph, so here's what's going on. Mm -hmm. um, I'd like to make sure that you're safe to operate a motor vehicle, so I'd like to run some field sobriety tests on you. Is that okay? Uh, let me talk to my wife. Not really. Not tonight. You know what? Honestly, it's just not a good night for a field sobriety test. But if you want to pick this up like tomorrow, next day or something like that, like we can totally set that up. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm going to do it regardless. No, that's okay. Okay. I just want to know what she thinks about it. Is it that's fine, right? Well, she can... She's I just hearing. want to talk to her about it, right? Dude, okay. this bumps me out because he looks so nice. Like, he's one of those people that just has a kind face. And the name Rudolph. Don't do it to us, Rudolph. Please, don't do it to us. January 7th, 2023. What day of the week is this? What day is it? Could you please tell me? Somebody else said this in chat. They said Friday night activities. It feels Friday. It feels Saturday. But also, they just had a baby, and maybe they're like, hey, you know, we've got a babysitter for the night, somebody's birthday party. We got to get out there. We got to have fun. We got to, like, go do something. Could be a Thursday situation. You know what? Here we go. This is my theory. I feel like it's a Friday night because it's giving Friday night energy, and they claimed that they left the restaurant right around 6 o'clock. Leaving the restaurant at 6 o'clock makes me feel like happy hour was over at 5 o'clock. They stayed for a little bit longer. Probably actually stayed until 6, 30, or 7 because you know they were lying. It's 2 o'clock in the morning. Y'all ain't leave yet. There's no happy hour on the weekends. January 7th, 2023. It was a Saturday. <laughs> Objection! Great point. Technically, it's Friday, suckers! <laughs> All right, never mind. It's back for the Fridays. Back in our court. Whoa. She can, she's I just hearing. want to talk to her about it, right? That's okay. What do you want to talk to her about? Exactly what you said. You sure? Go ahead. You can ask Thank me. You. Keep the window right out now. Damn, just open the door. It's locked. Try <laughs> Oh hey, Rudolph, hey, open yeah. the door. No, 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 I was just, okay. I told you exactly what I was going to do. Okay. What was he saying? Let, let's do that now, okay? Um, can I finish talking to her? No, I'm telling you to get out of the vehicle right now. Okay. As he displayed <laughs> passive resistance, Rudolph quickly put the vehicle in drive and oh took off at a high rate no. of speed. No, no. Before he starts another one, 1040 for now, no, no, he's... No. I need to see the car pull off. Possibly 5-5, no. five, five, lock himself in the door. Hey, I'm... don't, no, 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 no. Oh my God, they're running. Put it in the park. Car. Put it in park now. He ah! said no. <laughs> 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 After exceeding 100 miles an hour in a 35 mile per hour zone, me. he lost control of his vehicle, <gasps> crashing into a tree before no. fleeing on foot. I had to give us all a break for a moment. <laughs> How did we get here? How did we get here? This is like big. I bet you're wondering how I got here. Like energy. What the? F stop! Stop! Do it now! Wait. Police department! Stop! Oh my god! You know how we always joke and we say tase him. I want them to tase the unruly people, the mouthers, the you know. Well, I guess you are supposed to tase the people that go off in the pursuit. Dude, they fucking tased Rudolph. 
So, do you want the honest answer? Yes, I want an honest answer. Good. Do you want a really honest answer? Do you really want to know? I can give you this answer. He's cooperative now. No, he's cooperative. But do you really Are you injured? Know? I'm asking you a question. Alright. You good for now? Yeah. Right. Did she run? No, she fell out. No, 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 I fell out. She yeah. fell oh, out? That's my daughter. I don't even know. That time is mine. At least not hit me. It's a whole soap opera. I just talked to my daughter. I don't even know. This child is mine. Hey, thanks for not hitting me. <laughs> thanks for not hitting me. Brutal. Hello. I don't know. You're laughing. This somebody was laughing. Nobody's laughing. She fell think. out. Do you think I deserve to die? You okay? You think I deserve to die? Oh Are you injured right now? I got an ambulance coming. <sighs> Do you need an ambulance? Sir. No, I don't. Uh, okay. Are you, are you injured? No, 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 I'm not. Do any of you guys feel like you get deceived by people that like are, are attractive or have a kind face or just look like they wouldn't hurt a fly? And then they end up doing something crazy? Rudolph had a sweet face. He had a sweet face and a sweet name. <laughs> and now his girl is laid out because he done tra crashed into a tree and she fell out of the car. I'm gonna tell you what the situation is. You can take it however you want. Okay. I know that you felt that I was under the influence and you weren't gonna let me go. Dude, what is up with his accent? Where have I heard this before? All right, dude, I'm just gonna tell you what the situation is and you can believe it or not. But first of all, I was not drunk. Second of all, my wife, I'm not even sure if she's actually my wife because she might be cheating on me and I didn't sign the paperwork. She actually reached her foot around into my side of the car and she hit the, she hit the gas. So all of, and that's why we hit the tree. So really, I don't know how we got into this situation, but all I know is I want to see my daughter. Not sure she's mine. Really want to see her and her mom's waiting for us. So if we could just forget that this happened and I'll take that sobriety test tomorrow, that would honestly be so fucking chill. I'm going to roll you over to my side, okay? Yep. Can I have water? No, not, no. not right now. Can I ask you an honest question? Sure. Are you new? I've no. been doing this for over a year. You've been doing water. No, have you been a cop for like doing this for over a year? I don't know if that's relevant. No, I'm just Me asking. talking when I'm like, I really want to know. I'm not sure. You're not sure. It's okay if you have. You're gonna be okay. Okay. You are driving. This has nothing to do with you, right? So can I help you up, please? This looks very uncomfortable. You can't move. Alright, what hurts? Are you I was injured? asking yeah, him a question. Okay, are you injured? I was asking you a question. Okay. Can you, no, no, I'll, I'll, I will answer it. I'm I will asking answer question. you a question that's more important than how long he's been a cop. I'm asking you if you're injured. I can't say anything for you. I can answer it once I get that answer to question. Yeah, I'm not sure if he's going to be cooperative. No, no yeah. I am. I am. I am. I'll be straightforward with you. Okay. So are you injured? Are you going to answer the question? Maybe one more. Do you need to be checked out by an ambulance? Rudolph. What does that mean if I need to be checked out I'm by asking ambulance. if you're injured. Yeah, and I'm asking you, what does that mean? Because I feel... In, I'm in pain. Okay, where? I'm in pain in my. <laughs> I want to know what's possible that like I can claim injury for because I am experiencing a little bit of pain. So what do you mean by that? Entire body. Okay. Your whole body hurts. Yes. Anything specific yes. other than your whole body. I can't tell because I'm in shock. I know you're. I know you're shaking. It's okay. I'm not shaking. I can tell you. Chilly outside. No, she, uh, she's a passenger. I think she's just in shock. Can you pass me at uh, Chapstick? Yeah, no. life is out what of what time. Because you split up and I, I jumped out the car. Why were you guys running? We drank just a little. Okay. And it wasn't as much as he thought. And we were sitting there forever. And then he just said, I have to go. And he's not even a bad person. And she's just. Nobody's saying he's a bad I person. I know, but. Wait, wait, what did you just ask him? Second. Yeah. What did you just ask you? No, no, I can ask walk. that, right? Walk. You can walk. I gotta know if you were in the same position as Rudolph and the cops were closing in and you knew your license was revoked. One in the chat, if you would sit in the car and be like, oh, shit. All right, this sucks. I guess I'm going to jail and getting in trouble. Two in the chat, if you'd be like, well, if we're going to ride, we're going to ride. Better put this thing in drive. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I'm a strong one. I could never, ever could not do it. Why are you asking weird questions? See. Can I have water? No. What kind of car are you driving though? A Mitsubishi Lancer. Lock the side of the car. Quick. Lock the side of the car. Hand on the shifter. I just ran back to my car. I left him up there. I'm like, it's about to take off. Is there any way to have water? No, we do not have any water. Is there any? I see about getting we you some, but you gotta water. be cooperative. See, no, you can see about getting some? What's in your mouth? Dude, I just fell on the floor. Like, you can just look. Open your mouth and stick your tongue. You got like dirt. No, oh, yeah. You just figured it out. I'm just asking. 
Okay. Take okay, a seat and we'll figure it out. That. We don't have any right now. That's we'll, okay. we'll work on getting it. Just please sit down. What's the time frame for that? No time frame. Are you going to be cooperative or no, not? No, are you going to hurt me if I'm I don't not want water? You. No, but sit down. Just sit in the car. You're not getting water right now. No, okay, put your feet in. Well, that took a turn. Yeah. <laughs> My dumb ass said, was my... So I had, a, I had a good view. I saw him put his hand on the shift now. I don't know if you saw that. Well, I saw when you started going back. I was like, don't do it. And he I did. Yeah, I was like, I ran back. <laughs> no, it's good. That's good. I only knew what's happening. You had to jump on. Um, obviously, we're in the fields. Do you want to do them? I don't know if he'll be cooperative. What are you thinking? It, it changed a whole lot, maybe. He's in custody now. At least give him the opportunity. Firefighters like to talk to you. Can I have water? We do not have water, unfortunately. Okay, what do you have to aid me here? We have an ambulance. We have medical staff. We can just say, so what, what happened? Okay, I can tell you right now that I know how the justice system works. I know how things go. And okay, but well, what's uh, going on with you? We're, the, we're just a paramedic, so we're, we're, we're here to help you with any okay, medical so needs. If you're here to help me, I need water. And we don't carry water with us. That's do you have any type of fluid? Not, not that we can Rudolph, give you Do you have any, like, any pain or injury? I, I am a little surprised that they don't have any water. <laughs> Sometimes I think that people are asking for things in like a control way to like see how much of the situation they can control. But this guy's drunk as shit. I would not be surprised if he actually really would like some water. The injuries that I had, <laughs> yes, I can't really talk about them because you're saying that you can't aid them. So you're declining medical I'm assistance. I'm not declining medical assistance. Okay, then assistance. tell us what's wrong. I'm asking for medical assistance. For what? In the oh, simplest... somebody in chat said he can't have water before a breathalyzer. Oh. Version is I'm saying it's I need water. If you cannot provide me with that, I understand, and I wish it wasn't that way. But like, do you understand what I'm saying? Like, I feel like right now medically I need water. You tell me I can't, I can't provide that to me. So fortunately, like it looks like I'm gonna have to suffer. I don't want that. It looks like I'm gonna. That's not something that we we can take you to a hospital where they have water. Yeah, that that, that would be what. Well, we Honestly, so relatable. Okay, it looks like I'm gonna have to suffer. I get that. Too, but that's not that's not something that we would be providing to you. And then what are the other options? Because like I don't want to die. Right, we wouldn't let you die. Yeah, well, yeah. I don't know because like right now I'm saying I need water. Right. And it feels like it's you know dire. But you're He's so trying so hard to play the like I I was in custody and I was not given my basic needs, but he's like not entitled enough to play this card like he's trying he's really trying to get it out but he's he's not good at this we've seen some karens that are so good at this do you know what i mean does this make sense you're looking at me saying saying that you can't provide me with that like you can't provide me with the bible right because we don't carry the that bottle? that's not okay. something that we, we carry that's okay i understand we have other needs needs of, or means of giving you that if we I feel that, that i understand so what like how does that work what was that, that? Was, you know, giving you a, that i understand so what like how does that work <laughs> like giving you an IV with fluids and things like that, but that might not quench your thirst. That might just. <laughs> if I say that right now I need water and you just would like put me in some type of cell or some type of cage and you don't provide me with water, you're like I can't, I can't tell you that He's I'm gonna trying. be trying. Look, you'll you'll, you'll get water soon. We just, yeah. we're, <laughs> so we're, I don't think talk to these guys. I don't think you're you're getting it. We don't have any right now. You'll you'll right. get water in a little bit. Is that He's the only trying. Wait, you got, let's see how he is on the way into the station. When offered the option to undergo SFSTs or a breath test, he refused. Additionally, it was found that Rudolph had one prior OWI conviction in 2018. Oof. You guys are gonna put me in jail, right? Oh uh, yeah. And then what, someone's gonna have to bail me out? There's not gonna be bail on this one. Why not? Cause it's felony. Why is it a felony? Cause you fled and eluded the police. As per the female passenger. And crashed into a car and your baby mama, maybe, was just laid out on the grass, like while you were getting tased. There's an amalgamation of things wrong here. Just before Rudolph fled from the traffic stop, he uttered, I'm sorry, I have to say bye to... She also expressed feeling scared during the pursuit and was considering jumping out of the vehicle. As a result, Rudolph was slammed with felony counts of vehicle fleeing eluding an officer, second degree recklessly endangering safety, OWI causing injury, prohibited alcohol content causing injury.
misdemeanor counts of operating while intoxicated. Brutal. Bad. That was so bad.